Hello, gamers of the internet. We are back with Danganronpa 2. Goodbye, despair. We're about to do a test. We've left a little something in a room, and then we're going to go to the lift. We're going to go back in the room, which is the same room, but through a different door. We're going to find out if the thing in that room is actually still intact. That was a really confusing explanation. Well, this is a confusing thing. We we got to do this kind of bullshit in the troll, I'm sure. Oh, I know. This whole death thing is going to be centralised around this tower. I can see it now. Oh, I'm cool with it. I'm still worried that we're not going to get free time. Because, yeah, me neither. Because someone's got to die for us to escape. And when someone dies, you got to investigate. And when we investigate, we got to do a class I'm trial. I'm scared. I'm going to do a class trial. We'd find out who the kid is. If, I, if someone dies before free time, the rule was that I have to down my beer because mm -hmm. I didn't take a guess. Well, there is that too. And also, when we find out who the kid is, the chapter ends. Oh, shit, yeah. I'm so, not... yeah, are we going to have a free time or are we not going to have a free time? I must say. Oh. I must say, this elevator is rather quiet. It is like the toad wart. Oh, wait. Never mind. Is that like a fairy tale hey. reference? Toad's Wart? What's she talking about? Oh, the Toad's Wart? What's she talking about? Mm. Doesn't feel like we're moving extremely fast. Seems it's moving very slowly. I, I mean, she's a princess. You, do you know what? I don't think they're moving at all. What? Where are they going? I think mean, this is literally just to turn the rooms around. Wait, what? That's what they said, right? The two places are connected. Oh yeah, I suppose they are. I, I assume the lift just moved back and forth between the two places. Like, but there's no, if the two places are already connected, how would the lift move back and forth between oh, them? Oh man, this is going to be complicated. Okay, well, it doesn't sound like there's any movement. Mm. Oh, have you done it? Yeah. If the two towers are connected in the middle, the distance between them shouldn't be that much. Maybe it's just a really <laughs> slow lift. Oh, red. And look, we've got the final dead room to greet us. Oh, how lovely. Oh, yeah, what about that room? Yeah, what is that room all about? All right. Oh, all right. Let's head over to the strawberry tower. Oh, all right. What you got for us? Maybe. I'm worried how it's playing like this because like beach music while we're trapped inside a wasteland of a funhouse. <laughs> yeah. If two towers are connected in the middle. If the two towers are connected in the middle, the distance between them shouldn't be that much. Oh, is that saying the same thing? I think so, yeah. Oh, what? Just yeah, it's gonna repeat the same voice lines. All again, yeah? Well? Oh, yeah. oh no! Wait. There's a free laws robotics! No, I skipped! Oh, damn it. We can kick it again. It's fine, we got it here. It's, it's consistence of free laws that strive for safety, obedience, and self defense. Oh, Which means the first is safety, human safety. Humans are afraid Do you of have food. A minute? In simple terms, the first law s s stipulates, stipulates that locked. robots may not harm human beings. The second law is obedience. Robots must obey any order given to it by a human being. I see. I Third see. law is self-defense. When it throws that shit out of the window. As long as it does not violate the previous two laws, a robot must protect its own existence. Wow, that's fucked up. So if a guy's beating the shit out of a robot, he can't fight back. Because it's his lord and master. True. Why does Sonya know so much about this? She's also watched <laughs> iRobot with Will Smith. That's where I thought that was from as well. <laughs> Three laws of robotics. Or maybe it's something Japanese. Maybe she's watched Ghost in the Shell. Who knows? Is that in that as well? Don't they love anime over there in Nirvana Land? Oh, yeah, they do. Good point. Oh, hold on. That explanation is too insufficient. Let your teacher expand upon that. Leave it to me. And now I can finally act like a teacher. I shall reclaim my dignity right here, right <laughs> dignity now! Dignity lost in three, two, one. What are you guys talking about? That's not time to talk about that stuff. Let's head over to Strawberry Tower. Then, you are right. Perhaps we should discuss this matter some other time. She's going to be up there. Yeah, let's hurry. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it could have been worse, Monami. These weren't downright insulted. 
Yeah, you like just, it usually are. You would just reject it. <laughs> I don't like this. Creating this complicated building just to make us kill. Doesn't make any sense. Oh. Now then, let's just go in and confirm it! Uh, Isn't this elevator actually moving extremely slow? If so, the two houses might be surprisingly close. Hmm. Oh, the mysteries oh, that come with this house. I don't really get it, but let's hurry up and head over to the Strawberry Tower. As long as you ain't pitching everyone is free it's fine. Oh, Gundam. Gundam's all the way over there. <laughs> now then, let's see what result awaits us. Having fiends made up your mind, don't forget to pray to your god. Well, it's not like I have a... It's not like... Well... Well, it's not like I have a god to pray to anyway. My name is Gundam Tanaka! <laughs> I already know God has been wiped out by my very own hand. Damn, Gundam can be a really good RPG protagonist. Mate, you'd be awesome. <laughs> Wiping out gods. Hey, hey. He'd fit right in with SMT then, wouldn't he? Yeah, he would do. He summons demons and everything. Gundam's a new demi fiend. <laughs> if, we... if we go inside Strawberry Tower from this the door in Strawberry Hall, and if my handbook is still there, we can safely say that the two towers are the same building. Alright, let's find out! Here we go! If you press this button next to this door, you should be able to enter Strawberry Tower. Hey, hey! Then I'll press it. Stay back! Wait, step aside, you fiend. Don't call Chiaki a fiend. You call us a fiend, dude. Oh. In accordance Oh, it's voiced. Well, um, what's gonna happen? Go by four dark devas of destruction. Supernova. <laughs> Pierce through Supernova Silver Fox Sandy. I forgot they got their entire. So we got what we got. Raj Golden Hawk Supernova. Black, I can't remember the other black. ones. Black something. Black, black Shadow. Dragon. Black, black, black Shadow Dragon. Dragon. Yeah, Black, black Shadow, Shadow Dragon. Dragon. Yeah, that was it. <laughs> Choo, choo, I choo, choo, choose you, open button, click. Ah, it pressed the button. <laughs> <laughs> Truly, this is the, the skyline limited. Lamentation. Let, lamentation art of the demon man. <laughs> he just jumped and pressed the button. <laughs> <laughs> Soon the door of destiny shall open. Man, what power he wields. Wow. Amazing! Your hamsters are truly skilled. So you have a. Oh my god, he appeared on the right all of a sudden. Wow, he teleports. Damn. I see your eyes managed to follow Sandy's movements as expected of the Dark Lady. <laughs> the Dark Lady. Oh wow, Sandy's Son being given a title. Man, these two are in proper cahoots. I can see what people ship these two. You have my praise. Oh, I'd ship it too. I'd really ship it now that she's got a title <laughs> from him. But like next time, Kazuichi. Amazing, truly amazing. You must have a strong, trusting relationship with them. Just dress up in dark goth clothes. Oh my god. Oh. oh, and he's embarrassed. Yeah, I can see it. Thank you. <laughs> you didn't need to. Didn't need to bring your hat. Need to bother making your hands to press it. It's worth it. Oh, jealousy. Love triangle. It was worth it. Impress Sonia. Love triangle. Oh dear. I thought it's taking a while to open. Mm. It's fine, I'll go in there, Kamaru. Considering what we discussed earlier, the sensor will confirm that nothing is moving inside the tower, then wait for the other door to close. Gondor's my replacement waifu, guys. Ah. Oh. <laughs> well, I knew that. No homo. He's a robot, it's fine. Yeah. That doesn't count. True. But he's still my husband, though. <laughs> there, I <laughs> said <moment>. it. <laughs> At that moment. I heard a loud sound from the other side of the door. 
I can't like. Oh, oh yeah, there it is. Confirmed. So it is the same room. So that means that the towers are spinning around. Like the no. Wait, what? No, because you got you got a strawberry house on the right and grape house tower and this on is the, the connecting uh, house room. on the left. I'm sorry, and this is the connecting. Yeah, room, and then, I think the lights are just changing. Yeah, yeah. Okay, what I was going to say is that, yeah, I kind of liked our time we had with Nekamura, where it was just us and him. Yeah. It was like a, kind of like a Holmes and Watson kind of thing. Yeah, it's gone now. Uh Got everyone. Ah, look over there. That moment we set foot inside Strawberry Tower, Sonia raised her voice. When I look where she was pointing, it's there, the handbook. Confirmed. Jackie was right. Good job, girl. Should be a bit more loud about it. Nah, she was silent about it. Again. Yep. Mm hmm. Yep, there's no doubt. This is my student handbook. Huh? If the handbook Jackie left in Great Tower is here, then that means. <laughs> it seems we've confirmed it. Yep. Strawberry Town, Great Tower are actually the same building. And depending on whether you enter from Strawberry Hall or Grape Hall, the tower becomes either Strawberry Tower or Grape Tower. Meh, <laughs> were you thinking a bit there, Ben? Yeah, no. You've got your mouth wide open and you're staring at the screen. So, wait. When they say it's the same building, they're actually just in the same. Like, what? I I'm, think. I'm, I'm getting confused because, so basically, what they're saying is that this place is not actually changing. It's no, because you got the two. I think I think what you're getting confused at is when they refer to it as a tower. Yeah. So I think the, the tower is the center. Yeah. That we're inside right now, and the buildings are it's, on the left and right. So they aren't the same. Yeah. Like, the tower. If that makes things any easier, I think that's yeah, what they're referring to. Yeah, that's not our fault. But yeah, so tower and building mean two that's different things. The way they're wording it. Yeah. I would call it central hall myself, but yeah. whatever. Then that door would have the grape image on it. I see. It's not the exit, but it appears it's connected to Grape House's Grape Hall. Why is that statue of Sakura there as well? What's, what's the deal with that? It's such a weird decoration, I mean. But it also means that we have no idea where the exit is. Hey. Well, I guess that can't be helped. There's no way we'd actually find the exit that easily. <laughs> well, anyway, I'm surprised. I can't believe you already uncovered a secret like this. As expected of Chiaki, you're truly amazing. Hey, right, back off, Nagasar. Oh, he's proper getting in. He's feeling all the compliments. Go on a group of uh, no. spend some quality time. Oh, Ben, you've got some competition, mate. Nagato. Nagato. Oh, you oh. best do something. You can insult him all you want, but he'll just insult himself. This is a tough one, man. He's got fangirls too. He's he's well liked. Can't stop him. It's the He's hair, isn't it? It's his unkempt, messy ass hair. He really needs a fucking haircut. Normally, all you do is stare into space, but at times like this, you really pull through for us. <laughs> I think you're okay, man. She ain't interested in one bit. However, she was however, like, do not compliment me. Why was this building designed so strangely? You're so evil. What? That was a bit of an unnecessary voice line. Yeah. There's probably no reason, it's simply because it's a fun house. That's all the reason Monokuma needs. Hmm. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you again? Yes. I'm Monami! Why did you forget about me? Maybe one day you will get yeah. a chance in the spotlight. Don't know when, I don't know how, but maybe one day. One day, maybe. That reminds me, whatever happened to a Monokuma announcement? Huh? What do you mean? According to my internal clock, it's already past 10 p.m. Oh, oh shit, it's late right too. Despite that, why hasn't there been a Monokuma announcement? Monokuma oh, what? The, 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 the HUD turned into nighttime mode as well. Oh, wow. Allow me to answer! 
every single day up until now, I have consistently let you know when it's morning and night on this island. Let me guess, he's not gonna tell us anymore. Oh, is he gonna fuck with us even more by messing our sleep patterns up too? Jesus, Monokuma. And thanks to that, you've been able to live a normal life. Oh god, don't you guys. Did you guys mistake me for some kind of pretty alarm clock? Well, I'm not gonna lie, you were pretty tall on me. Hello. <laughs> oh well, it's totally true that I'm pretty. <laughs> hey, what are you trying to say? Hmm. For the time being, the Monokuma announcements are on hiatus. What? Yeah, so he's not going to do it anymore. What? Which rely on the Kamaru. What? Oh, but well, we've got a clock anyway. You've got an internal. Yeah, we got a better alarm clock. You can't go outside and there are no windows here. So it's not like it matters if it's morning or night, except it really does. There's this thing called sleep that you robots do not need. Yeah. But we do. Also, let me think of a little something to replace the Monokuma announcement. Don't. Is he gonna like tempt them with like food pictures and shit instead? <laughs> oh god, they, the, the houses are doing that job already. Oh, here we go. Beep, beep. <laughs> I don't like and it doesn't even tell us. Oh, the anticipation. What's wrong with him? Oh, if there's no announcements, you can just look at the clock. Or just look at Nakamura's chest. Yeah. Both Strawberry House and Grape House have clocks in their first floor lounges. <laughs> if I don't look at the clock, I have eternal clock, so it's no problem for me anyway. This already part 10 p.m. I'm starting to feel sleepy after hearing that. Hmm. Since you don't have food, it might be better if we rest and conserve our energy. Hey. For now. Let's just decide our room assignments. The police. No, they, oh, it's, to, it's very muffled as you can tell because it's outside of this horrible funhouse that are inside. Yeah. <laughs> very <laughs> loud though. Cool, 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 cool aid siren's not gonna get through these walls, I'm afraid. Oh <laughs> no, he's trying though. Uh, PC plot can't reach us here. Um, Each house has five guest rooms, so we should first decide who's going to stay in which house. Why don't we make things simple and split them between the boys and the girls? Yes. Yes. Let us do that. Man. That's a bummer, but uh, well, I guess it makes sense. No late night hijinks for you, Kazuichi. The will of then, then ladies first. Now then, let us begin. <laughs> now then, kitten, choose which house you would like. Did he just refer to all the ladies as pussies? What? No, he's just saying kittens. Yeah. That's a term. Kittens? I know. Hi, like, kitten. How's it going? Oh, yeah, a kitten's like a cute little, like, yeah, cat. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's a younger cat. <laughs> yeah. Gundam's just been Gundam, okay? Yeah, yeah. He's a breeder. You can say shit like that. Yeah, it's you fine. can. Oh, yeah, he's a I keep forgetting he's a breeder. I keep forgetting he's got his talents, man. I know. It's because, like, he's not. <laughs> he has hamsters, so I should remember he's a breeder. Oh, dear. Let's just choose Grape House. Starting at a red room is just going to strain my eyes. Oh. Fair enough. Oh. In the men's room, Strawberry House. Strawberry men are known for passion. <laughs> I like it. Well, red is also the colour for fire. It's true. Hey. Also, each house had guest rooms of varying quality, right? Oh, yeah. Damn right. Nato, Nato, nah, Nagito gets the crummy room. Yeah, I think Nagito should get the crummy room. Yep. Wasn't it two deluxe rooms, one standard room, and two crummy rooms? For now. And we need to decide those next, huh? But there are only five rooms in each house, right? Then only one guy will be left over. <sighs> that means there's only one appropriate way to solve this! Oh no, not rock, paper, scissors. Rock, paper, scissors? <laughs> Appropriate way. <laughs> oh, it is rock, paper, scissors! Rock, paper, scissors, of course! Suddenly, the rock, paper, scissors battle between six guys has begun. Oh my god. And the results? <laughs> oh, sorry. I ended up winning so easy, of course no, you would. You use your power of bullshit to win that. Yeah, ultimate lucky shoot. Speaking of talents that we forget, Nagato does indeed have that fucking horse crap ultimate lucky bollocks. Mm. That's right, I totally forgot that Nagato is the ultimate lucky For fuck's sake, it's not fair. <laughs> so I take second place. 
That's why I'm not getting bored of being <laughs> being on top. First worst, huh? second best. Mm. It's decided! You two will go to the deluxe room! Now then, we're going to third winner. <laughs> God, it's me! I'll be resting in the standard room! Meaning that we get the crummy room. Damn right! Oh, man. Wait, we don't get any room. Oh, wait. Hang on, there's six dudes and there's five rooms. Yeah, that's what it said. One of them's gonna get left out. How's that gonna work? Me and Kazuichi yeah. are next. <laughs> so I get the crummy room, huh? Well, it's better than rooming with someone. Oh, for fuck's sake, come on! Now you've just been snide. I don't know if he's rooming with, if he's talking about us or Nagato. He's totally referring to us. Yeah, if he is. He's literally been pushed on the whole Hajime as a traitor thing. But it's uh, Nagato's fault because he's fucking announced it to everyone lie, and planted the seed. Thanks, Nagato. I'm not gonna lie, but Kazuichi is slowly going down on my ranks right now. Really? He's getting annoying that he keeps referring to us as a traitor. It's so. annoying. I can see why he's doing it, but yeah, it's kind of getting like, old he's, now. He's just doing it like someone. Yeah. Uh, we don't need you. We get it. He's acting like a teenage high school girl. <laughs> yeah. All of a sudden. Chatting with his mates behind on Vax. All the gossip and whatnot. Oh. And Nagato being the alpha bitch that he is caused all of this. Yeah. That's unfortunate, Hajime. You can rest in the lounge but try not to catch a cold. Oh, fuck you too. Oh, you're an asshole. Rick! Oh. I know Joe does have a glass bottle right now, so I'm hoping he doesn't throw it at the This delivery. ain't plastic, motherfucker. <laughs> hey. Hey, how about you Grape House girls? Did you all pick your rooms as well? Why can't Hajime just sleep with one in one of the... There's only a couple girls. Oh, uh, may we? Yep. Well, that sounds better than sleeping in, like, a bloody... On the lounge couch. <laughs> Yeah, we did. We had a brief discussion and settled from the smoothies. Oh, the ladies just talk it out, or the men have got to can do it by action. Yeah. Sonia and I have the deluxe room, and apparently Akane wants one of the crummy she rooms. She wants a crummy room? What? Why? Huh? Huh? Why do you choose a crummy room? There's still the standard room left over. It's not like that. It's good enough for me. You guys might think it's pretty crappy, but it's a palace compared to my home. Wow. Oh, yeah, of course. Akane hasn't <laughs> lived the. Of the uh, the most comfortable of lies. I still need to know. Um. So there's a standard room and a crummy room left. <laughs> Hajime, if you would like. Oh. One of them. Bless you, Sonia. Oh, Sonia. Thank, thank you very you much. Very much. Huh? Hey, hey, hey. Oh, shut up. You yeah, you getting jetty, Kazu. Yeah. Getting jetty. No, it's gone and getting there, but so are we. Ah. <laughs> uh, you can't do that! No rest for the Why? wicked, eh? Why not? Well... I mean, it's dangerous. Hajime might be the trainer, oh, you know? Oh, come on, Kazu! We used to be bros, man. Yeah, she was angry at him, though. Oh, shit. What are you... What are you... <laughs> that's a weird voice she to give. She puts the booming voice of a princess. Oh, my God. Gets all queeny on her. What are you saying? Oh, shit. Miss Sonia? No. Oh. Oh. Wow, wow. Huh? Huh? So... We haven't doubted Hajime. Oh, oh hey. you do care. You and I don't think you try to trick us. <laughs> it seems like you're the only one who thought Hajime is suspicious. Oh, oh come oh, on, Nagato! Oh, As if you're fucking explaining yourself out of this. I think Hajime is a traitor. You said that at the beginning, you fuck. He just tried to break the, the bromance between Hajime and Kazuichi. He's just Kazuichi. trying to get out of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, guess what, Nagato? You're never gonna get out of it. <laughs> I mean, I gave you credit in chapter three, but you're still a prick. Yeah. <sighs> really? Of all the people, you're gonna say that? You're really gonna say that? Right? <laughs> <sighs> Hajime, you can use one of our leftover rooms. Thank you. Thank you. Aww. I feel bad about using the stand room, so I'll stay in the crummy room. But even so, it really helps that I have a place to sleep. It's better than nothing. You might as well take the standard room. Yeah. Might as well. Sonia and Chiaki have got the deluxe rooms. I can't yeah. even chose the crummy, crummy room. room. But, but then Hajime's gonna have the other crummy room. You're just beating yourself up there, man. Yeah. Now then, it's decided! We should turn in for today. It's just showing modesty. Yeah, I guess. Aw, oh, man. It looks... 
It's like it doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Man, Kazurishi's salty. Man, he is. Well, I for one think that his tears are delicious. <laughs> <laughs> and so Probably won't like that noise again. <laughs> well, guess what? You did. <laughs> and so all the guys except except for me ended up staying the night on the second floor of Strawberry House. And all the girls plus my leftover self stayed on the second floor of Grape House. Thank God Mikan isn't here. She probably find her way into our bed somehow. <gasps> oh, shit. And uh, why are you still here, Miss Monami? And why are you staring at us like that and give a fuck? Jeez. Jeez. Right. <laughs> oh weird. my god. Let me do, let me try and do a jeez like her. Good luck. Jeez. There you go. Just a night fuck. I was forgotten. Rest in peace, Mashiro. God rest us all. Well, I'm used to it after all. <laughs> what? What was that about? You suspicious fucking thing! <laughs> you little fuck! So this is the second floor of Grape House. I wanna look <laughs> at the archive! Choosing Grape House is definitely a good decision. Hmm? What do you mean? Um... You see, Strawberry House is a... Is a qua, qua, quadrilateral. Qua, quadrilateral. But Grape House is a hex... Hexagonal. Hexa yeah, hexagonal. <laughs> That means this place is far more spacious. It is quite a good bargain. Yeah, you got a point. On on the on the map, they did look bigger as well. For a princess, you sure do think about petty stuff. Uh, that's the little things in life. Ah, so it makes sense though. She would want the place that's the most spacious. The most palace-like. Yeah. Uh, so sleepy. The lux rooms are the two rooms at the far back, right? Is it okay if we go already? Yeah. Well, two rooms at the front of the crappy rooms, right? I just may use the room next to the lounge. Then... So the standard room across from the lounge will remain unoccupied. Easy as pie. I shall prepare nameplates for our rooms later. I shall also include portraits of everyone's faces. Are you going to draw them? They're like pens and paper in here. Yeah, how are you going to do that? You don't... You don't really need to draw our faces, but the nameplate might be a good idea. Oh, this is bad. This is really bad. I just can't stop thinking about the whole not being able to eat thing. Yeah. I would panic in this situation. I would be freaking the fuck out. Yeah, me too. These, these, these kids are actually taking it very well. After reaching the limits of her sleepiness, she actually struggled over to her deluxe. Well, except for Akane. Man, I'm worried about Akane. Me too. Now then. I shall now then I shall retire for the evening as well. Good night everyone. Good night, Sonia. <laughs> Good night, Akane. Good night, see you tomorrow. After exchanging good nights, everyone went into their guest rooms. I should get some sleep too. Uh, mm, I think I was assigned the crummy room that's next to the lounge. No, I wanna explore Oh, oh this is ugly as fuck. It's like, it's like wine bad. glasses and... Oh man, even... Oh my god, do you realise how evil that is? Grapes, grape juice, yeah. drinking, <laughs> liquid... I see it. Why is keep out here? I don't know. You're, You're not allowed to enter this dead room. How dare you? Wait, it's kind of weird. Wait, we actually can't go... Can't, we can't, can't explore the dead end. Oh, oh, what's the archive? So do I. Oh, I see it. Oh, fine. Um, to the room we go. Dead time. We get the crummy room, don't we? Yeah, but is there any other places? Shit, Pat. I've been walking around quite a lot. Have we? Oh, look, there's a there's a crap in the toilet. You're just Makes not. Sense. You're not grooming. You're, you're just, just a, not a gorilla. You're just a child. Well, the child will grow soon. Hmm. I wonder what we'll get next time. Yeah. I wonder if there's legit Shitemi. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a pile of shit with legs walking about. This deluxe room, either Chaggy or Sonya is staying here. Yeah, okay, fine. Yeah. I'm not going to get to do anything. You got to go sleep. I don't get why Hajime just doesn't choose a standard room. I don't know, it's just being polite, I guess. I guess, but at the same time, it's unoccupied. It's not going to hurt anyone if he takes it. Oh, this one. This is our room. Um... Akane chose a cr crummy room of her own accord. I oh, know. Really isn't that crummy. 
This is a surprising shabby guest room. It's a little cold in here. The draft coming from the door is making me hungry. Oh, don't. Oh, you're going to wake up in the morning and not have breakfast. <gasps> Fuck That's that it. shit. But I shouldn't be talking like that. For now, I need to enjoy it no matter what. Oh. No matter what happens, I would definitely prevent a killing from happening. They need to find a way out of here fast. Yeah, this is not good. I won't let Monokuma get what he wants. And how are you going to do your that? You're Jesus trapped. Christ, is someone going to be dead tomorrow? Oh god, I oh. forgot about these Monokuma fears. Let's put our thinking caps on because look, we got a bunch of dots and bullshit on the screen right now. Do what we, the hell is that? Do we drink? No, <laughs> we ain't drinking to that shit. That's fucking code. That, that is yeah. on purpose. No, guys, we ain't drinking to that whole shit. I mean, there's technically three dots. Okay. It's got to come naturally. This yeah. feels like it's on purpose. Yeah. What is this? It's kind of like code or some shit. It's emojis. It can't be. I'm, what the fuck is this? What's the point? What? what? Sad face. That was this. Where's the sad face? To tell you the truth, I'm out of ideas. Morse oh. code edition. Well, commenters, lovely commenters. I'm sure someone knows what that is. Please let us know because that was quite a confusing Morse code edition of Morikuma Theater. Um, oh, we're drinking anyway. It's a bit weird that how every time Hajime goes to sleep, he's dreaming of Monokuma. Oh God, do you think just all the trauma and everything that he's going through right now yeah. is just giving him all these like hallucinations of Monokuma yeah. feeding him philosophy? Yeah, that's deep. Just like us, it's morning already. Oh God, it feels like it's night time. It doesn't even feel like. Oh God. Now that there are no Monokuma now, so I don't feel like my usual self anymore. Oh, this is so messed up. There should be a clock in the lounge. I should head over there and see what time it is. Mate, I'm really... How the hell did I can't even make those? The nameplates on the door. What? Oh, oh she, wow! She actually drew little sprites. If we check the map... So, so, Sonia is the bloody <laughs> sprite artist for Danganronpa confirmed. <laughs> <laughs> she drew that shit. Wow. They're very well done as well. Okay, what the... Did she go back to the boys' room and make those as well? Oh yeah, I well, she did. Did he say go to the lounge, right? Let's see. The time is... 9am. It's later than I'm used to waking up, but I guess it still counts for me. Yeah, no alarm clock for us. Now then, what should I do now? This kind of situation, panicking will accomplish nothing. Oh. Might be better if I spend time like I normally do for as long as I can. I should find someone to talk to, or it might be a good idea just to stay in my room and converse my energy. <laughs> yes! Oh! Oh, we got free time! And that is where we're stopping it. Oh, you're not going to do that like, one bit before we stop? It's a half hour video, Ben, that's so Oh, that no, is true, that is a bit mean. Alright, fine. One free. And the commenters will have your head if you end it this early, I'm sure. <laughs> they, they don't like me ending the part, so... Yeah. It's fine, I'll edit this part. <laughs> you literally... Always I always say that. Uh, it works, okay? Sometimes I do get to edit it, sometimes I don't. That's true. Leave it to chance. <laughs> so, free time, yeah! Um, oh, so we have a free who? time in here. Shit! So who are we gonna have free time with? Can Wait we... a minute, can we not get to the one on one machine? No! I've been saved! Yes! Oh, for oh fuck. Wait, all hold the pain on. and all no. the suffering! I don't think you have been saved. What do you mean? I think the Mono Mono machine's in that final dead room. Why would it be in there? It's called the final dead room. I mean, yeah, I'll probably die if I go over with that Monokuma bullshit more, but I doubt oh, I'll be in there. Oh, come on, no Mono machine. What about the Mono. Oh, maybe it's in the archive. Yeah. Speaking of the archive, we yeah. can actually look up there now. No, let's go up there first. Yeah, there. Let's, let's look at shit before we hang out with peeps. Alright. Now's our chance. Wait, how do we get to the archive? It's all the way up on the third floor, I believe. Yeah. By taking the stairs. Oh, yeah. Hey, we can do, go in the do, archive. Do, 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 do. Oh my god, it's got a big dumb Monokuma face in it. I love it. Oh, what is oh, this crap? Love... Monokuma reference room. Oh, man. And we can go inside. Yes. Reminds you of the... Uh... Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh. <laughs> it reminds me of the Masterminds room in Danganronpa 1. It had the Monokuma face on it. So this is the Monokuma archive that Nagato was telling me about. Apparently there are no clues that might be useful for escaping this place, but... 
in the future it might be necessary for you to know about the enemy. Really? You sure it's not going to be a bunch of horseshit? Oh look, Monokuma fear. That's Danganronpa 1 Monokuma fear. That is Danganronpa 1 Monokuma yeah. What's on the bookshelf? The Spare Boys, Monokuma Successful Youth Edition. What? What a shitty title. <laughs> what is this place? Oh my god, is it going to be a bunch of titles? What's on the bookshelf? One of Kuma's later to work. There's no way my little sister is this incompetent. <laughs> Doesn't mean Monomi. Don't tell me he writes art article when he gets bored. Hey, even masterminds need a hobby too. What's this on? Let's see what's on the bookshelf. Monokuma's cute meaty diary what? volume one. What is this? Is this Monokuma's diary? Has th that guy been keeping a diary this whole time? <laughs> Dear diary, one of me Greetings. sucks. Yeah. Oh, you can read it. Oh, it's, 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 it's Monokuma voice. Okay. <clears throat> Greetings. I'm the Monokuma in charge of Monokuma. I'm the only one who looks good in a fresh salmon jacket. Oh my god. What have we got ourselves into? Anyway, it's still pretty recent, but I made a tremendously huge discovery. And I shall share it with you guys, starting now! First, squat like you're sitting in an invisible chair, and put your hands behind your thighs! Okay, okay. let's do it. Got our chairs. Hands behind our thighs. Alright, yeah. let's go. We don't know how to do that. The ultimate comfort. Then, hold that position as you raise your thighs. If you keep raising it higher and higher, don't you think you start floating higher and higher into the air where my legs are, but not my ass? You would, right? Right? This hurts! Isn't this amazing? Isn't this a revolutionary discovery that will cause a reform in traffic laws? Let me not traffic laws. If I can't do it, I don't have eyes. <laughs> Bummer. That felt like an addition of Monokuma for <laughs> It looks like there are still several volumes to this diary. What should I do? What? Wait, so can we read more? Oh no, it's just. Oh. There's volume two. Oh my god, oh, there's boy. more! Pika, yes! <laughs> what the fuck? Hey man, what's up? Monokuma, aka Monokuma, is in the house straight out of Dangarumpa. I respect Hi, Ali G! Hey, what's happening? It's an Ali G reference. It's an Ali G reference. No, totally an Ali G reference. Fucking hell. I'm in Tokyo, just got here, yo, I'm the best! No contest, my business is such a success! I'm a psychopop, beefy, cute little bear, making a t-shirt and watching me shake my derriere! Yo, are you stunned by the ill skill of my funky fresh rhymes? Mad love to all my monokuma heads, I'm crying for the passionate love I'm feeding, man! Hey, you! I'm your neighborhood, say woo! I'm the Bruce Bounce the Boss, discount soy sauce! Everybody clap your hands! You got dang a romper, baby! Amen! <sighs> Dead. I exerted a lot of effort Dead. doing all that. I've embarrassed myself live. I, need, I think you need the gangster out of it all now, mate, for that. Oh god, I don't even like rap. <laughs> like, Bloody hell. There are several volumes to this diary. Which are, we're going on! There you, oh my god, What's there you the go. The Monokuma rap skinny white guy edition. <laughs> Monokuma cute muted diary volume 3. I'm bored anyway, let's take a quick peek at it. I always like to talk about how I became Monokuma. Ooh, origin story. Back then, I was just a lowly salary man who worked for a few I can't hate Monokuma, man. What, uh, what is this character? One day when I was helping my lover Juliet conduct research on stuffed animals, I was attacked by assassins and sustained critical injuries, which drastically changed my appearance. <laughs> they just throwing a whole bunch of horse crap in there, jump, fucking, they threw it in a blender and they've got a Monokuma origin story. Yeah. From there, I received emergency surgery from Juliet. I obtained a body made of cotton and metal. And that's how I obtained superhuman powers. He's got a superhuman origin story. And so I became Super Monokuma. Began my revenge against the assassins who attacked me. Looks like there are still seven volumes. Oh this. my god. Yes! Hell. Volume four. Meaty diary. This makes up for not being able to do the slot machine. <laughs> <laughs> it's a mysterious drama. 
<laughs> it's having the same effect. I'm dying. <laughs> I like power. I hate powerless idiots, even though I'm too familiar with them. I'm also loved by everyone today. Oh, by the way, this is Monokuma. Yeah, we gathered. Today, I shall tell you a circumstance leading up to my appearance in Danganronpa. <laughs> Breaking the fourth wall so bad. Guess it was started <laughs> around 1905. <laughs> It was a hundred fucking years ago. <laughs> you might know it as the year Bloody Sunday occurred in St. Petersburg. My manager received an offer to appear in a game by a certain company. However, my manager was actually a salmon. Plus, what is with Monokuma and salmon? Can someone please explain this to me? <laughs> Plus, she was on the verge of laying her eggs, so she was extremely busy. Because of that, she was only able to write a memo that said, Offer from Game Company S. It's pretty impressive that a salmon could even write a memo. Anyway, I was able to instantly figure it out just by looking at the memo. My genius 100% cotton brain decided that this was an important offer that would change my life. A game company known as... A, comp a game company known as Company S. There's obviously that fearsome first-rate company that gets bashed online. <laughs> you know, the fourth side one. Is he, is he taking a stab at Square? <laughs> yeah. Is he fucking taking a stab at Square? <laughs> Damn, that is some lit shit, Dangarumpa. Damn. <laughs> I thought it was Square as well. That is. Is that seriously square? It's gotta be. Four sided. Yeah. These motherfuckers. Spike Chonsoft. Mm. You're, you, you guys are something else. I really put on some clothes and headed for Company S. <laughs> However, you know it's called Company S. It wasn't actually the four sided one. Oh, sorry, mate. Don't get to go on the latest Final Fantasy. <laughs> There's a company that's famous for lots of reasons called Spice Chonsoft. <laughs> ah, oops. Spice Chinsoft? Space Chingcroft? Oh well. Anyway, when I found out who they were, I felt so rejected that my strings started to fray. However, I'm a professional. I was touched by a producer's enthusiasm, aka cash, and I really <laughs> presented the offer. And that's how I ended up in Dangan Rupal. Ah, oops. Dungan Ronpal? Oh well. Anyways, this punishment for making me misunderstand, I decided to eat my wife for dinner that night! Literally. <laughs> Ever since then, my eyes have been open to the tasty flavour of salmon. Oh, that's why you like salmon so much. <laughs> the age of wife. <laughs> you tasted like salmon. <laughs> Let's do it in volume soon, what should I do? Yes. Keep going, baby! Fucking war. Hey! I come this far, I can't stop now. I mean, yeah, we have come this far. <laughs> no. Why stop now? Let's just invite all of this. <laughs> this zany horseshit. I can't. Oh. <laughs> <clears throat> Hello, I'm Monokuma. Today I shall teach you the best way to arrange a meaning. I regret voicing this character. I bet you guys want to see me so badly. You're like a bunch of dogs barking like crazy and stretching your leashes to their limit. So, first you need to prepare your money. Ideally, you want to prepare around $88. $88. Dangarompa 2 should cost about $44, <laughs> including sales tax. Oh god, VAT included. Just like life, it's important to take any action with plenty of money in your hands. Yeah, go get that revenue. Joke's on you, Monokuma. This is a two-part, two-package deal. It's bundled in one and two. One point two, motherfucker. <laughs> yeah. Next, head over to the nearest video game store and tell a staff member. I want to buy Danganronpa 2. To be fair, not a single person in any game store here in the UK will have any clue on what the fuck Danganronpa is. <laughs> yeah. I'm just saying. Yeah. Us, in, uh, uh, all the English guys who work in game and all of that have don't know, don't even know what Japan is. They don't. Seriously, they don't. I mean, like as soon some, as some as soon as you plays. mention a J Japanese game, they go, "Oh, this guy wants that weird, obscure Japanese game." I'm like, "For fuck's sake!" Yeah, that's why I never actually ask for the games I'm buying mm -hmm. in, like, if I go buy it physically, because yeah, not a lot of game employees aren't very clued in. Although I will say, the ones in Stratford actually do know what they're talking about. In London, yeah. Oh, not in my town. 
whenever you say, oh, I want to get Shimigami 2, Devil Survivor 2, they're like, do you mean Battlefield? <laughs> yeah, that's exactly Call what Duty, I mean. the new one? Oh. <laughs> anyway. Yeah. Make sure you say real loud so the other customers in store hear you. Actually, I have a funny story to tell you, Joe. Oh, God. I, I, do I say it after this? Yeah, well, it's not really funny. It's just that I correct, because correct, I remember when the Switch was coming out, mm -hmm. and someone said, can I play, like, they were holding up a Switch game, and they were holding up a Wii U, and said, can this work with this? <laughs> and the game employee <laughs> said, yeah, it shouldn't be no problem. What? Yeah. You're shitting me. Oh, I'm not even lying. That oh, mate. Yeah. That's screwed And then up. I had to say, no, that's for the Nintendo Switch. Oh, so. you saved him. Yeah. Good save, Ben. And then the game employee looked really angry at me. <laughs> well, fuck that guy. I know, right? Well, just because you're doing his job better than he is? Yeah. For Christ's sake. Yes, the Switch, Nintendo Switch, works with the Wii U. And game never hired me. The most so relevant cool, console yeah. in the world. I applied and they never hired me. Oh, I'll bear that next time, my friend. Yeah. Uh, mate. Oh, yeah. <sighs> yeah, g g game employees don't know a lot of this stuff, which um, makes me sad. Yeah. Make sure you say it real loud so the other customers in the store hear you. I want to buy Dangaron for two, starring the famously cute Monokuma. I dare, double dare anyone to say that in their local <laughs> game shop. Uh, I, I want to see it recorded though. Someone's got to hold a camera and you've got to stand in the middle of the show and go, I want to buy Dangaron for two, starring the lovely cute animal. <laughs> Monokuma. Oh, the staff will tenderly bring you the item, as if they're carrying you one in for literally <laughs> like a cushion. It's handed to you. Yeah, if you just give them money in exchange, you'll be able to splendidly obtain Danganron for two. <laughs> oh god. But wait, don't rush. The game will be wrapped with clear plastic that you must rip open. <laughs> oh. That's right, rip off the plastic. Oh, I love the smell of new games. There's a nice smell. Mm. Ah, gonna play for share this one. <laughs> the only person who has any right to rip off the plastic is the first person to buy it. Rip off the plastic gently, as if you're undressing a lover. Oh, Treat it like it is a woman. <laughs> Once you finish with that, you'll be able to take the game card out of the case. Game card? <laughs> oh, right, Vita. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. it's a disc. You dang, dang rompers evolved. You've now gone to CD, congratulations. Yes. So I must have done this thing then. Yeah. All you have to do now is insert the game card into your PS Vita, but once again, don't I, rush. I wish it said, I wish it just said now that I'm not a Vita, what's that? <laughs> yeah, you mean PSP, right? Yeah. <laughs> After you take out the game card, you must intentionally break it in half. <laughs> what? <laughs> Why do I do something so crazy? This is what you might be wondering, but don't worry. The fact that you prepare more than enough money <laughs> will be very useful here. Do you want to buy it twice? What? This comes a fucking catch. <laughs> oh. You must immediately return to the video game store and yell loudly at the staff. Please give me another copy of Dangaron for two, starring the modern day sex symbol <laughs> Monokuma. <laughs> oh, this is kidding me. <laughs> if you follow these orders, you'll find a way to meet me. Oh, oh wow. wow. Monokuma is just going to walk out of the... the, the I, I can't I can't think of funny jokes anymore. Oh, God, just kidding me. So funny. <sighs> yeah, wasn't that an amazing lecture? I haven't said anything impossible. Seriously. <laughs> I think every volume of Monokuma's diary. But now I feel pleasantly, pleasantly. I was literally about to say that before. was exhausting. Yeah, right. I mean, yeah, right. I think Wait, there's still like more that. things in there's here. There's still more things. The book says have well bestseller, the ten, the ten <laughs> killing <laughs> commandments, <laughs> Monokuma personal guide to success and happiness. <gasps> oh my god. I need a drink after that. Somehow, I suppressed my urge to throw it on the floor and put it on the back on the bookshelf. Is there any more in there? Yes. Monokuma in a car. The book is... Oh yeah, yeah. The book is, here is... Deep stories that really happen and will probably make you cry. All 100 volumes of That Love by Monokuma. That Love? I should pretend... Oh, is that? Sword. Kama Sutra Monokuma edition? Yeah, pretty much. Is that everyone? Famous Monokuma quotes volume one. Oh no! This <laughs> one free massage ticket. Of course, you're the one who's going to give the massage. However, if you keep using the free massage ticket, you will eventually master the massage fist. I can't. 
Never underestimate the power of the massage fist. You can press Kempo masters around the way you punch someone. You're like, oh. There's more, isn't there? Ooh. Yes, oh, there is. Fuck me. I'm a bear. I have no pockets. Bear, bear. I'm a bear. <laughs> I was hiding between the asphalt and the white line and Metropolitan Expressway, but nobody saw me. Oh, I get it, because you're black and white. I got really lonely and depressed that racist, but I didn't cry. I held it in until I went to bed. <laughs> I couldn't be proper and serious. That's definitely disguised me around salmon. I... Oh, you don't know? It's common sense if you're in New York. <laughs> oh my god, that's sex. Huh? I've never seen you before. Were you ever one of my servants? Hey, if you're my servant, tell me your servant number. Henchman24.0. <laughs> Tuna isn't a bird because it can't fly. With this, I have finished presenting my proof. What the fuck? <laughs> you eat tuna, it's a fucking fish, you fuck. Just because I'm a bear doesn't mean I lick honey all the time. Judge me like that as a form of harassment. <laughs> fucking weave the fuck. Oh my god, at my seaside veranda, I sit meat tea and watch special pizza about shocking videos of TV. I actually just peaceful time, I already just want the darkness in my heart. Is that a Kingdom Hearts quote? What? I don't know. <laughs> darkness, heart, makes you think Kingdom Hearts. This is fucking 10 volumes bullshit. By transcending all living creatures, all the ladies are under my dominion. Whoa. That's a Gundam quote. Fuck me! Why is it not stopped? It's still fine to say no, that's wrong, but I will never allow no, that's wrong. Lol. Is he taking the piss out of our quotes now in the tri cast trial? <laughs> I accept all comers. Mostly leave me, will be torn limb from limb. Or the baby boys, whim from whim. Fuck, stop, no. Why is there 13 volumes? Let's talk about something that happened a while ago. Back when I stood at the fucking safari park. At the time, the park was in decline. Everyone there was ignoring the rules. <laughs> doing whatever the fuck they wanted. Those guys had no order at all. It was a wild world. With a weak fall victim to the strong. Social Darwinism. Woo! During this time, happened to meet a nice guy and then Gorilla. Oh, we had a Gurimi. Is Gorilla like the male version without oh, the bow? Yeah. Maybe he's got a baseball cap or some shit. As you can guess from his name, he was a fucking pig. Gorilla was bullied at the park a lot. Just like bullying, so I stood up for him. It was my assassination <laughs> fist that I developed with radio exercises and beat all those guys in the park by force. To be continued. No, oh. tell us more in volume 14. Oh my fucking god, it exists. To conquer in the park, I became the overlord of the park in both name and reality. <sighs> I should be thankful to Gorilla the Pig. He was the one who gave me the opportunity to fight. I'm not exaggerating when I say they helped me become the bear I am today. I don't normally say it because it's embarrassing, but I should take this opportunity to thank him. Gerudo, thanks to you, I was able to become strong and annoying as fuck. The taste of pork, broth, ramen, and deep fried pork cutlets I ate were the best, and that's where really it fucked up. When I tried to eat them, it was too oily for me to finish. Sorry about that. If you're reincarnated, become a pig again. I'll probably be able to eat oily food by then. That's all for now. Bye now, is it? Are you sure it's not a super secret boy in 15? I found it! I found the nipple! Good for you! It's just... Oh. <laughs> I don't... You gotta carry on. Just got really... <laughs> Where is this going? Please, <laughs> carry on. I can't. S okay. Have you read this quote then? Yes, I'm reading it. I'm dying. <coughs> oh, you're gonna lie. I'm gonna shoot you with my sim. <laughs> I'm looking at this, and I'm. Am, am I? What? <laughs> I'm good at rock paper scissors. Even I can Fuck off, you can make well. rock too, you clench that stupid <laughs> little fist of yours. Oh. Is there more? Oh my god, how long. <laughs> more common. <laughs> well, I'm a people, but you should be able to do it if you're doing it for yourself. So I think you should be more complacent than I think you and the other will be that by. I feel complacent about myself for saying such a beautiful thing. <laughs> you do it for yourself. 
What? What? Why are you taking this game so seriously? How the <laughs> fuck can I not? How the fuck can I not? <laughs> You've just made 19 volumes of all this horseshit. My voice is breaking from all this screaming and shouting. So this is. I ain't end. saying sorry, guys. Oh, I ain't saying sorry. I worked hard and read every last word, but I can not wow. say I never expected anything like that. After all that. <laughs> Waste so much time, I guess. The saying. Hindsight is 2020. After all it. that, there's no Voim 20. I actually feel fucking cheated after no. going through that shit. <laughs> oh, come what on! What a fucking tease. End the video. No, it's over. We're done. We're done. Oh, yeah, Voim 20 is fuck all. No, end it. End <laughs> this fucking shit. Now!